What's up everybody, the Game Hunter channel with another episode of Firefall, basic tricks and tutorials or guides or walkthrough or whatever you want to call it. And this episode I'm going to be talking about my favorite um, class, I'm talking about the engineer class, and more specifically about the engineer bastion battle frame. Okay, this is a basic loadout that I'm carrying my engineer bastion, the Tesla rifle is the main and exclusive weapon that I'm using, it's really interesting. It should a beam that actually does a lot of damage, like an electric damage to your opponent. But also you can use it in an alternative mode or you can repair your your sentry guns and all your deployables. So it is really useful. Um, the engineer class, of course, is a battle frame specialized in providing battlefield support. So it's not like a battle frame for everybody, especially at the beginning. We take a look right now, real quick, to some of the sp uh, specific abilities of the uh, engineer bastion sentinel path. Sentinel path is really cool. Actually, it's, what it's gonna do is gonna uh, regenerate and gonna heal all your or your uh, deployables in the area. And fortify, which is the also another exclusive of the engineer bastion is that it's gonna repair all the deployables in front of him and, and also it's gonna increase the damage for a few seconds so it is pretty cool uh, the engineer the engineer the engineer the engineer engineer is capable to survive by himself in PvE during the game uh, I won't say that during PvP that's like another story uh, like I say it's a support class so you depend too much in your deployables your energy shield, your sentry guns, your ammo pots and stuff like that. So it's not that easy to start. I mean, a lot of people like to play with the engineer because it's a rather ways different to the <laughs> classic assault, which is a classic grunt. Everybody like that because it's really good in PvP. But we're gonna take real quick. This is a quick look of the three battle frames that you can get with the engineer. The basic is the accord, then the bastion. That's the one that I'm using right now. It's basically the master of the defensive technologies, and it's gonna try to keep my teammates alive. That is uh, the main objective of the engineer battle frame, especially the bastion, right? Um, and we also have the other one, the electron. The electron is uh, a little bit more aggressive. It's called the ODE12 bastion. I think it's called no that's the sorry that's the bastion the electron is the AAE 01 electron and it's actually designed to do more damage and it is a little bit different to the uh, the bastion but like I said I'm not gonna talk about that one this is like a mini wiki episode of the the engineer uh, bastion Okay, I'm getting confused now with all the Electron Bastion Accor and everything. <laughs> but you guys see, when you do a Thumper mission, it's really easy for for you to be able to control uh, a small, uh, even a probably a medium uh, Thumper. Because of the Sentry Guns, that you can upgrade the Sentry Guns to hit some heavy Sentry Guns. Um, like I said, the Sentinel part is really interesting because it heals all the other deployables and do a little bit of damage to the targets that are in the area. So it is uh, good if you have a good of, uh, group of friends in your army that they uh, love playing with the engineer. You can start deploying a bunch, a bunch of sentry guns and have some sentinel pods in the middle providing all the support, right? Uh, the energy wall is a little bit more complicated to use uh, uh, that skill you have to shoot and it's gonna create a shield only if you get contact with an, uh, an enemy okay right now using this is the other gun that you can use with the engineer is the grenade launcher really useful especially when you detonate your enemies is deadly but this was a really quick look of the engineer bastion take it easy fellas